Don't worry about it. Just replay the logo. Twentieth Century Studios. Boo! <laughs> Aren't you supposed to be Twentieth Century Fox? Disney, I have a question for you. What were you thinking? 20th Century Fox was okay just the way it was. Exactly. But oh well. At least these movies we're about to show on this disc have the 20th Century Fox logo. Well, all four of them do, yeah. And I'll tell you what those movies are. They are used people. Uh, I don't have that. The Vanishing. I have that. Jack the Bear. I have that. And Lord have mercy, the Beverly Hillbillies. Norman Byrne. Norman Byrne, yep. Jim Varney, best known for portraying Ernest P. Worrell, portrays Jed Clampett. Was the Beverly Hillbillies a box office flop? I don't know if it was a box office flop, but I know the movie got heavily negative reviews. Oh, then it looks like we have two features on here. Two extra, two extras. Well, let's look at the first. Oh, it's an episode of Greed from its original Fox broadcast. The college rivalry episode. And what about this? Oh, it's another episode of Greed. But which episode is this one? Oh, this is a January episode. January 2000. All right. Now on to the Fox tapes. We're going to start with Used People, which I've seen the movie once a long time ago, but I don't remember much about it. I've never seen trailers for it on other Fox tapes and whatnot there. There's the Fox video logo from 1993. Everybody knows that. Yep. Oh, it's the studio store, the Watch and Wear uh, promo. And a theatrical preview. Okay. Oh, it's a preview for trailer for Rising Sun. Rising Sun, I have that on the UHS. I have it recorded off one of the movie channels, and it stars the late Sean Connery, along with um, Wesley Snipes. Wesley Snipes. And I know that Sean Connery was the executive producer of this film, too. Oh. Yep. Interesting. Home video preview. Oh, well, it has the the best reason to own a video as a sentimental one, but it's a different one. Hmm. This is something. Home Alone. <laughs> you good little fella now. I'm open the door. Pshew. Hmm. Yeah, this promo for the, the best reason to own a video is a lot different from the one from the year before. Hmm. The Simpsons Christmas special. <laughs> Ow! Quit it. Ow! Quit it. Ow! Quit it. Ow! Quit it. Hey, what's that? Ow! Quit it. <laughs> that was when Bart had to get his tattoo removed. Some of the many dreams worth keeping right. from Fox Video. What? This is the opening to Use People, right? Use People, yes. It's a 1993 VHS. Yeah. There's the 20th Century Fox the, logo. That's why the sentimental one, uh, that's why the sentimental one, uh, promo is, uh, different. Okay. Oh, and it's also made by Largo Entertainment. All right. Now, the Largo Entertainment logo has the its theme playing over it, but the 20th Century Fox logo was silent. You don't see that very often. Mm-mm. But oh well. Now we're going to move on to, I believe, The Vanishing? I think so. Oh, yeah, there's the Fox video logo from 93. 
All right. Theatrical preview. I wonder what preview this is. Hmm. Can't tell. Oh, it's the Beverly Hillbillies. <laughs> Home video Tony preview. No, main bird. This is an R-rated movie. Marley Matinelin, D.B. Sweeney, and Martin Sheen are in this particular film. But what is it? Can't tell. I know that Marley Matlin is hard of hearing. What you can't hear could kill you. Ooh. Ooh. Hear no evil. Oh, okay. There's the 20th Century Fox logo, and once again, no fanfare. Uh. Yeah. That's okay. Now we're going to move on to Jack the Bear, which has no previews on it whatsoever. Just the Fox video logo and 20th Century Fox logo. My copy of Jack the Bear has previews. So I'm guessing your copy is an original printing, whereas mine is a later printing. Yeah, I, it's from a rental. That's what I'm guessing. But it does have the music's opening theme playing over the logo, unless that's like a song of some sorts. But, eh, who knows? Right? Yeah. Anyways. I'm now on to the... My, uh, before we get to the next movie, uh, my copy of Jack the Bear has a preview for Mrs. Doubtfire. Oh, it does. Okay. Yeah, it does. I know that the original VHS of the Beverly Hillbillies also had previews on it, but mine is a later printing, so I guess there's no previews on this. I guess mine's a later pressing, because there's no previews on here either. And it just has the film's opening uh, theme playing over the logo with some guitar music, so that's pretty cool. And we'll go ahead and wrap it up right here for this part of our Fox Movie Collection. Part 12 will be coming soon. And before we uh, wrap it up, 20th Century Fox may be 20th Century Studios, but 20th Century Studios will always be 20th Century Fox. 